Good morning, St. John Newman School. I am Nina Rodriguez. And I am Kristen Clavan. We have school mass this morning at 8.30 in the main sanctuary. Teachers and students, please proceed to the church by 8.15. Please stand for prayers. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Today we remember St. Jerome. The church regards him as the greatest of all the doctors in clarifying the scripture. God's holy word. As a man of prayer and purity of heart whose life had been mainly spent in study, penance, and contemplation, Jerome was prepared to be a sensitive interpreter of spiritual things. In the early Christian church, St. Jerome undertook the amazing task of translating most of the books of the Bible directly from Hebrew into the common language of the time, Latin. This translation was later pronounced the authentic and authoritative Latin text of the Catholic Church. Heavenly Father, let us never forget that the tasks ahead of us are never as great as the power behind Thank you, Lord. Amen. We continue to pray together during our morning offering. O oh Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your Sacred Heart. In union with the holy sacrifice of Mass throughout the world, for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. Amen. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by the National Anthem. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. reciting our St. John Newman mission statement. St. John Newman Catholic School provides a quality Catholic education. Rooted in the Gospel, committed to academic excellence, faith formation, and service to elders. Developing active community members who model Christianity in both words and actions. On this day in history, in 1822, Joseph Marion Hernandez becomes the first Hispanic to be elected to the United States Congress. In 1918, President Woodrow Wilson gives a speech before Congress in support of guaranteeing women the right to vote. In 1927, Babe Ruth becomes the first baseball player to hit 60 home runs in a season. In 1947, the Baseball World Series broadcasts on TV for the first time. In 1954, the, US, the USS Natalis the world's first nuclear submarine is commissioned by the U.S. Navy. It's time to announce our birthdays. Happy birthday to Dylan Mendoza in sixth grade. We have several birthdays this weekend. Tomorrow's birthdays are Joey Masso in third grade, Riley Mondaka in sixth grade, and Mrs. Donna Murphy. Sunday's birthday celebrations go to Morgan Savage in 3rd grade and Jesus Trujillo in 7th grade. Happy birthday everyone! God bless you and make it a fabulous weekend!
Take us.